Hey everybody, it's Chance, back at it again in the closet grow. This one's going to be about bird seed today. Some flower seed to be exact. This is a 20 pound bag I actually got at Walmart for about $9. I mean, think about it. Compared to your $15 or $10 a pound, I'm paying half that for 20 pounds. And I'll show you how it's doing as far as, you know, germination stage. Which is, this is it right here, as you can see. So I'm not BSing you on that. The 5th, which is two days ago, roughly at nighttime, almost midnight, I planted these. As you can see, they are germinating. So... Uh, same day I planted regular sunflower. So, we'll uh, compare. These ones are probably a little bit more far along. But this is two hours sooner than the other ones. So, it's possible that's why. But I would say they're pretty close to the same. We'll take a look again at the other ones, but look. It's, uh, it's pretty close, pretty similar. Take a look over here. Yeah, I'd say that's pretty much dead on. The same, pretty much even. And so, there you go. You can use bird seed to grow microgreens and save you a bunch of money. While we're at it, I'll just go ahead and show you a quick update. Show you how things are going. This top row here, these blue stickers, which is actually on the other side. But yeah, these blue stickers means they're the freshest, newest ones and are not necessarily ready to, to harvest yet. But uh, yeah, this is red, red arrow radish. It's looking beautiful, nice and thick and lush. I normally have gloves on when I do this, but I wasn't planning on uh, doing this at the moment. But anyways, here's some basic salad mix. Also the blue label. So it's fresh still. It's very nice. Another radish. Should be the same as this one. You know, same time. That's really nothing. It's just lettuce for outside garden. The red and yellow means this one needs to be harvested because this one is the 23rd so 5 plus seven. it's 12 days old this one here these bottom rows are also blue labels they're fresh we got broccoli and basic salad mix the broccoli is a 2 on the right and the salad mix is on the left of course, you got my new blueberry and blackberry plants here. This quadruple red means that one's going in the trash just because I let water sit in here. And this you can see right there, and it kind of got moldy right there. All this over here is fine, so I'm just going to eat that myself, but I'm not going to sell it because just because of that little mold spot I don't want to risk it and I don't sell crap you know what I mean so here's some of the stuff that started that, that I started for the outside uh, garden portion it's a uh, bunching onion and some giant noble spinach that started of course down here I got uh, basil mustard and some more lettuce of course, I got eight more trays germinating, which you already know about them. Up here, I got some nasturtiums. This is how you spell it, just in case you want to know. It's an edible flower. Bunch more lettuce. There's my uh, new sunflowers that I just started recently, and the speckled pea. And of course, I got some more up there. I actually got a burlap experiment one, but that'll be on another video. Well, that's it for this update. Once again, you can use
bird seed to grow microgreens. But that's for sunflowers. All right, see ya.